my note and thank you, Mr. Bajcheta. Uh, dear Mr. Vlatovic, dear Mr. Bajcheta, our dear colleagues from EU delegation in Montenegro, Mr. Enstrom, dear participants and colleagues, it is my great pleasure to participate today at the Horizon Europe matchmaking event. First of all, let me stress that the Ministry of Economic Development welcomed this initiative and I really do hope that event like this, when we are joining all forces and efforts in order to promote the program opportunities, will become a standard and hopefully lead to a number of great project applications and partnership. I'm particularly happy that this event get a wide range of the relevant stakeholders from Montenegro and open the possibilities of networking with the stakeholders from EU and associated countries. I'm delighted with the fact that Montenegro and the European Commission signed the Horizon Europe Association Agreement for 2021 until 2027 last week, which um, allows Montenegrin innovators and researchers to participate fully in the world's largest research and innovation program with a budget of almost 100 billion euros on equal terms with beneficiaries from EU member states. We consider Horizon Europe as one of the most important and key programs for the further development of research and innovation through the partnership between EU and associated countries. This will enable Montenegrin researchers, companies, scientific and research institutions and innovators to develop projects and technologies uh, and conduct research that will contribute to meeting global challenges. Participation in this program will also further strengthen their capacities and support further integration of Montenegro into the European Research Area and Innovation Union. When it comes to the third pillar of Horizon Europe program, which is Innov Innovative Europe, we have a special responsibility to promote the opportunities deriving from it in the forthcoming period, as well as to provide support to our institutions in order to foster the participation of Montenegrin innovative organizations. Therefore, the improvement of our participation in the Horizon Europe is one of our main tasks and missions. Referring to the innovative and innovation component of the program, I would particularly like to briefly remind you uh, that the government of Montenegro has put its full focus on innovation-driven economic growth. By supporting innovation, we can strengthen our economy and create high-value jobs and new opportunities for Montenegrin companies, but also for the research institutions. For this reason, we are fully committed and working really hard on, est on the establishment of the efficient implementation framework for the innovative ecosystem that will enable full participation and involvement of all relevant stakeholders in the process of creation and implementation of innovation policy. It will definitely facilitate networking between the innovate national institutions and strengthen our position toward EU and international scene. Moreover, the Ministry of Economic Development invests in innovation and technological in, uh, in development by implementing innovation policy in order to strengthen knowledge-based economic development. In this regard, let me remind you that we created an adequate policy framework for financing innovation through dedicated program for innovation for 2021 until 2024. And the goal of this innovation program is to present at one place, all relevant innovation supporting programs planned in the forthcoming period, which will make it easier for the innovation community to recognize all instruments that will be available and focused on the entire innovation development cycle. It means from the idea itself to its commercialization and access to the market. I'm very pleased to share with you that innovation program for the first time announces the support of the Ministry of Economic Development to the participation to Horizon Europe framework program for research and innovation and a special program line of support will be opened in 2022. In this way, we will test our support in the following year and in collaboration with the beneficiaries decide whether this is an adequate support or we should redesign it or improve or maybe add some new program lines in the forthcoming period. Finally, 
the operational program for the implementation of smart specialization strategy with an, with an action plan for 21-22, currently at public hearing, recognizes the important role of the Horizon Europe for strengthening the international competitiveness of micro, small and medium enterprises, promoting and reinforcing Montenegrin position on the regional and European research and innovation stage. S3 is our particular focus, speaking of the strategic orientation of innovation policy, so we do consider the Horizon Europe as a leverage and important source of funding for our priority S3 projects. We do believe that together with the countries sharing our same priorities, we could join forces and foster our possibilities to get funding from this high competitive program. We also really do ha have a great expectation regarding our participation in Horizon Europe program, but at the same time, we are fully aware of all the hard work and efforts that we should invest in the forthcoming period. Building and maintaining strategic partnership is one of the crucial preconditions of the successful participation in the program, and this event is all about this. But I'm convinced only the first one in the series of the similar networking events. I'm very looking forward to our successful collaboration in the promotion, supporting and networking relating to Horizon Europe program. Thank you very much for your attention. I'm quite aware that I use that much your time, but this is one of my favorite topics in the area of uh, Ministry of Economic Development. Thank you so much and wish you a very fruitful day.